Hey, yeah, Nyan, I've come to introduce you to GCSE Computer Science as part of your options offer. So we study the Edexcel GCSE Computer Science, okay? So there's different exam boards, we use Edexcel. Uh, you'll study six topics. So you will study uh, data, which you've done a little bit of in year eight, you may remember from binary, data representation, hexadecimal, etc. We will study computers. There's a topic called computers in computer science. Okay, and it's kind of what components are inside of that box and how they work together. You look at networking, so we'll look at how networks work and how information is sent around the internet. So how does the latest Netflix show you are watching, how does that actually appear on your TV when you ask for it? We will also look at issues and impacts of computing technology. So we look at legal aspects, we look at environmental aspects, uh, things like that. In September, oh sorry, you will also learn programming. So Python programming is 50% of the course. So if you are interested in programming, okay, you don't have to be the best programmer in the world right now, but if you have an appetite to be able to learn it, then that is um, obviously of use because then you will, you will try your very best. You'll be assessed in two, uh, two exams in, um, in your GCSE studies. One will be paper-based, which will look at the, the data representation, the computers, the uh, networking, and the issues and impacts, as we've already discussed. And the other will be a two-hour on-screen Python programming exam, where you will sit your actual exam on a computer in one of our computer, uh, one of our computer rooms. I don't think I need to go in and talk much about career links. You, you will be able to know that there's programming jobs out there uh, there's loads of jobs that require you to be able to use computers so there's loads of careers out there network security you could look at artificial intelligence which is coming through obviously um, in the news quite a bit recently you've got programming jobs you've got all sorts of different careers that could be linked to the gcse computer science qualification if you do want any more information i'm in enterprise too thank you very much